It is the most unexpected and unforgettable motorsports experience for families and fans, and it's coming to Salt Lake City this week. Joining me now for this sponsored interview is one of the drivers, Kayla Blood, driver of Soldier Fortune. Kayla, hi, good hi. morning. Thanks for having me. We're excited to be in Salt Lake City. So happy to have you. I love this event. We look forward to it at my house every year. This is Monster Jam, and if you've never been, let's start by describing what the energy is like and why it's so fun. I mean, you get into it the minute you start watching. Absolutely. The energy is like no other. And whenever you do come to Monster Jam, it is really for everyone. You will find something within the two hours of a Monster Jam event that will keep you coming back each and every time. And it could start off with Monster Jam Racing, or it could be the two wheel skills challenge that we're doing now. And that's where we put these 12,000 pound Monster Jam machines on two wheels. And we're doing tricks and all kind of crazy things. And then Monster Jam Freestyle, which is everyone's favorite the backflips the crazy crashes big air you, that's where you're going to see all the greatest stuff. So there's something that someone's going to take away from there and say, I'm coming back to Monster Jam next year. It's really fun, too, when we have it at the Rice Eccles Stadium because you have a lot of space yeah. to really go full out and do those tricks. Absolutely. So I actually origi originated on the um, Arena Series. So coming to these stadium events and having the room to throw your Monster Jam truck in the turns and get 50, 60 feet of air, it's absolutely insane and a whole nother level, I feel like. But we are enjoying it. Um, like I said, I started in an the arena series, so I have been at the arena here doing events. So now I'm back for my first time, and I'm able to do the stadium here. So I'm excited to meet some of those fans that I met a couple of years ago and uh, show them what I can do on a stadium floor. Oh, and the fans <laughs> are so dedicated and so passionate about it. And you see how big those trucks are. But when you say 12,000 pounds, I yes. mean, that's just a whole new level. What does it take to even learn how to maneuver? Over that in the air to do a backflip. Is it scary to attempt that kind of thing for the first few times? I mean, a competitor and someone that is as competitive as me is going to come out here and see what these guys are doing and watch the other drivers. And I want to do those things. I want to be just as great as them and consistent and have confidence that I'm going to be able to maneuver these tricks. And it comes with a lot of seat time. Each and every if, each and every minute you get to be inside your Monster Jam truck, whether you're wrecking or you're doing great, you know, you're learning something. Thing. So all the seat time in the world, and you know, at the beginning of our careers, we have uh, what we call Monster Jam University, and um, Tom Mintz is our professor there, and so he actually goes over every aspect of the event with us, whether it be racing, two wheel skills, freestyle, and any and all of the guys are here and willing to give us any little bit of advice. So you got to take everything you can and see what you can do behind the wheel. Of course, we love when there's a female driver. That is just the coolest to me. And what is it like to be a woman? in this arena it's very empowering I feel you know we have a lot of females in Monster Jam and we're all successful on our own perspective tours and um, you know we're out here showing little girls that girls can be in a 12,000 pound Monster Jam truck and drive just as good as them we're beating Grave Digger we're beating Maximum Destruction and all of these fan favorite trucks and uh, you know we're making a name for the women in Monster Jam what a <laughs> feeling we also saw some footage of kids going to meet you and what is that like when they are at the pit party which happens before the show you can go and get the autographs and talk to the drivers what does that feel like when little girls and boys come up and are just in awe of what you do we love it you know being able to connect with our fans is the most important thing and they are why we're here doing what we're doing they love monster jam and we love going out there and putting on these amazing events for everyone but it is super awesome whenever we are at the pit parties and you have those interactions with the fans and you have those conversations and you it makes you realize just how much monster jam means to some of these these kiddos that are coming and watching you every weekend and the impact and effect that you're having on them on their lives where they're watching you out there doing these amazing things but it's very special and um, you know we are able to connect with people that we talk to on social media for weeks and years and to be able to see those people and put a face to them you know and really make that connection and that relationship it goes a long way oh it is really special there are moments that my little boys will never forget yep. and it's really funny I was telling you when we sat down that they started this love in the house, but it's carried over to me, and now I'm just as passionate and love going. It's really fun, too, because you can rate 
the drivers. Yes. You have a hand in who might win the night. Yes. So you're involved. Absolutely. So we love that. Um, obviously racing, you know, that's a really dependent on the driver. So as a competitor and a driver out there, I want to start the event off uh, on a good note and possibly win racing or get to uh, get really far in racing. But when it comes to two wheel skills challenge and freestyle, you guys are able to vote on your favorite driver. You're able to vote on what you think was better than the other driver, or what trick they did that was better. So we really feel like that's an awesome way to connect the fans to the actual event. And, um, you know, you're getting to say, hey, I uh, thought my driver did better. I thought yours didn't do so good. So we're going to give you a zero. <laughs> yes, go and be part of the action and cheer them on, especially Kayla Soldier Fortune, May 4th, Rice Eccles Stadium, MonsterJam.com, and follow along on social media. And I told Kayla it's one of the favorite trucks in my house. So, of course, I had to bring my own. Would you sign this for me? I would me? love to. Oh, thank you so much. No so nice problem. to meet you. you and too. thanks again to Monster Jam for sponsoring this interview.